What's up everybody, Sparewood again here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Metal Gear 3 Snake Eater. Uh, when we left off we were trying to blow up the warehouse and Snake just got this caught. Was found snooping around my underground vault. And then they found her apparently, which, which doesn't captured. make anything Look what better. You found on her. What did you find? Makeup? Lipstick? Or a slide? The philosopher's legacy. Hmm? Scusama? This microfilm contains all the information oh. regarding the legacy. Sorry, I was trying to tell me you've only got a few minutes. This film itself is the philosopher's legacy. Well, do you mind if I borrow it real quick? It was the smell that gave her away. Smell? No. Not the perfume. Okay. It was gasoline. Motorcycle gasoline. Ah. She reeked of it. Well, she did like her bike. To think that lovely Tatiana was a spy. Yeah, who could ever Tatiana turn on along with her too. a commander that just beats people up and kills their own comrades all the time? So, basically, he's kind of like Palpatine if he were healthy and able to beat you up physically. Because he's got all the lightning stuff, you know? <laughs> yeah, he doesn't sound too broken up about it. Yes, she was an obedient <laughs> It almost pains me to have to kill her. <laughs> kind of. Ah! Ow! Isn't that right? It's a heck of a way to get woke up. What was that? Do you have something to say to me? I think she does. Go to. Well, that works too. Yeah, I feel like this is gonna, yeah, yeah, lead to some intense you tasering. I've had enough kisses from you. Oh, I should have known. But, but, ten minutes. Sokolov wasn't man enough to have a lover like that. Just like the KGB to send something so beautiful yet so deadly. Well, what is the philosopher's legacy? Very well. I'll oh, good. It We're gonna I get another cutscene before we get to a fight. Lovely. During the last great war, the most powerful men in America, China, well, and the Soviet yeah, Union that's... had a secret pact. The pact was a blue to say that the Axis powers the Allied powers the world order. To secure <clears throat> victory in the war. The three countries pooled their resources, ah. conduct the most covert types of operations and research. Wait a minute. I'm looking at the glowing the on the map. Oh, there we go. Technology, the Cobra unit. There's the USSR. And they amassed an enormous sum of money to fund these projects. Enough to fight the war five times over. Why didn't they just, like, fight the war that then? That wealth <laughs> is the philosopher's legacy. After the war was won, the three countries were to divide the philosopher's legacy amongst themselves. I'm guessing that didn't work out very well. This explains why the United States and the Soviet Union were able to steal away the best scientific minds in Germany as soon as the war ended. Well, I figured it was just a gunpoint. Like, but our hey, great motherland has worked for the bad guys, so... Rivals. We possess enormous wealth, the most advanced technology, and overwhelming power, assets fitting of our great country. Okay. My father was one of the men in charge of managing the philosopher's <laughs> legacy. I can't tell who that is. The confusion too blurry. ensued after the war ended. He devised a series of ingenious plots to ensure that the Soviet Union would have total control over the legacy. I love how they're taking the this long, drawn-out process instead of just saying he embezzled Which the money from the three countries. Australia and Hong Kong. Like with microfilm See, contains I'm done. Record of all those transactions. I'm already done with that. The microfilm holds the records of the transactions After he used to embezzle death, the money. I learned of this secret. Okay, we're done. Obtained the microfilm. Let's move on. With this money and the support of Brezhnev and his allies, wait, who's Brezhnev? This fortress of Groznygrad and 
Granin's research facility. I know Khrushchev was supposed to be like the president at the time, but who's but that Gran fool Granov Granin or whatever? Failed to produce results. I was forced to turn to Khrushchev's dog Sokolov and his invention, the Shagohod. Well, that seems to have worked out much better. My position in Gru made it too troublesome Whoa, to attack frames. Sokolov's facility directly. But the spy network established by the secret pact still existed. I used it to contact the boss. Ah. Suggested that she defect. Suggested? Hey, why'd she defect? Why'd she come over to my country? Enough to see things my way. The world was once one. But the conflict between the philosophers has torn it in two. We will use the legacy to heal that rift. To oh, make the yeah. World mm -hmm. whole again. Mm -hmm. Building a mobile this, we nuclear tank. A stoppable trump card with enough power to bring order to the world. Yeah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> that trump card was to be the Shago Hod and the Cobra unit. Yeah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> I'm calling it right now. Not gonna work. I have lost the Cobras. Well, I still have the Shago Hog and the Legacy. There is nothing America can do to stop us. Well, I boss, could take this someplace safe. Kill you, kill her, kill Ocelot, blow up the base, and yeah, then it would have stopped you. <laughs> Give it. Give it here. Good, good, care <laughs> good, Vogan. Give me the chip or film. I guess is what it is. He wouldn't have come waltzing back in here unless he had a reason. The C three's been stolen. He must be planning some sort of sabotage. Nope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No sabotage I'll here. If there are any surprises waiting for us. No sabotage here. I'll dispose of her as well. Everything to me. <gasps> Plot twist. Fight like a warrior, Volgan. As opposed but to of course. like cheating and being cheap and using lightning. Cause it seems rather cheap and unfair. Side Let note: me face it. Something I just realized. How am I gonna trank this guy? Waiting for this. He's like wearing body armor and shoots lightning and everything. Get even. Ah, you got two guns. No more judo and no more field strips. Huh? Well, you hold both the guns, so what do you want me to do? Enough of this. Well, that doesn't seem like it'll be good for me at all. He's mine. You will stand right there and watch. Got it? Please, Colonel, let me- Silence! I don't think he's gonna let you. You know, it's com- it, it's- it's very... flattering to have everybody wanting to kill me, you know, but... <laughs> but, uh... Can we, uh, get this show on the road? Seems like there's some, um... Time. Time, Sorrow. Time. Oh, good. Seven minutes. Honestly, I have no idea what the drawing the guns on Sorry both of us delay. was about. Thank you. Let's move on. Let's get this show on the road. Let's get started, shall we? I mean, unless you're just really, really opposed to doing this at all, in, in which case, let's just not. The 
This is a once in a lifetime battle. Let's Not really. A good one. More a once in a game battle. Because this kind of stuff happens every Metal Gear game. <laughs> Um, this just seems so unfair. Okay, dude just burnt his coat off with lightning. And he's wearing, like, body armor with metal, or with, uh, bullets, a bullet belt. Does this really seem fair to anyone else? There's also nowhere to hide. Just you and me now. And we have about five minutes. I was gonna say, you can at least give me weapons so I'm not fighting barehanded. <laughs> Catches the knife and it's like, Psk, ah, went through my head. So just to be clear, this is what's considered fighting as warriors, when the guy still has lightning and everything, but you give me a pistol. I mean, I'll take it, but still. Huh? You're mine, son of the boss. I don't really like where this is going. Oh good, and we're timed. Lovely. Alright. Okay. That didn't work out. Okay. That didn't work out either. I don't want to put away my gun. Ah! Aha! I dodged it. Okay. He's got a shield thingy. Woo! Okay. Oh no. Okay, so when he shocks you if you actually have your gun equipped... Can I shoot him right now? Nope. Um, what is gonna happen here? I don't like that the whole room turned blue. Dang it. But if you get hit by that thing... I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Stop putting up the guard thing. It's not fair. Oh! Oh good, so we can't even punch him either. Dang it, man. I'm trying to get him, Ocelot. Shut up. Ah! Everyone. Okay. I have a feeling the time is going to be a bit of a problem. Oh no. You can you can stay over there. Dang it. Man. I, d I didn't get him. Whoa. That was close. Dang it! Okay, seriously? <sighs> Alright. Oops. Apparently we don't need the stutcher. Um... Okay, so it's disinfectant, styptic, bandage, knife. Not in that order for anyone who's actually trying to dig a bullet out. I'm working on it, man. The time, I really feel like, is gonna be a problem. Oh, I'm out of... Oh, lovely. <laughs> lovely. That's not good at all. Are there seriously no Trank bullets anywhere? You gotta be kidding me. Thank you. Oh, come on. Chimney Cricket, man. So there's basically, like, never a time that you can shoot him. Man, dude. This guy is crazy.
easy. I forgot how hard this guy was to fight. I know it's bad. What is this? I just need stamina. And time. And more ammo. Seriously, his shield is... Oh, there we go. So we basically have to run him out of power. And when he's out of power... Then... He'll have to go back and charge, and when he goes back to charge is when we shoot him. Right? Woo! That one was a little close. Wait. Killer. Oh! Jeez! Man, man. Oh no. I should have done that. Crap. Okay, this is not real easy to be honest. Do I have... Oh, I do. Okay. We're gonna need to use this. Okay, this is not good. This is not good at all. <sighs> oh, I just realized that it completely drained my ammo when he shocked me or something. Ah! I don't have enough time. There's not enough time to fight this guy. Okay, I have a feeling we're all just gonna blow up. Cause, seriously, what is going on here? It's like I can't fight him and he's got energy for days. Okay, seriously, I'm missing something. I don't remember how to do this. We're all dead! Woohoo! Alright, I'm gonna pause it and try and figure out what I did wrong. I'll be right back. Okay, so, funny story. I actually did the first part of this fight because I found out what I was doing wrong and might have forgotten to push the record button, so I'm doing it again, but at least we know what we're doing now. Um, so, I was reading on the GameFAQs thing, like walkthroughs and whatnots, a couple of things. First thing, this... One of those lightning bolts, I don't know which one it is, one of them tracks you if you have your gun out. Um, the other way, the other thing is you've got to get around behind him. Ow! Not like that. I did it before. Crap! I don't want to punch, I want to grab. So when he's got the, the lightning thing off... Oh! Nope! Nope! Nope, dang it. You kind of see wh where I'm getting at. Is if you hang around him... Dang it. Don't have your gun out, though. Oh! Oh, we got around behind him. Dang it. Oh, crap. That's very close. So, basically, the, the key is getting to his back. Because he's vulnerable to the side and the back. Like so. And when he puts his arms up like that, he's kind of he's kind of mad and you're not going to be able to hit him. Come on! Come on, boy. Woo! Whoa! That's too close. Okay, hold on. We gotta we gotta fix this. So you can see that this is a much better way to do it. Is either just run around behind him or you can actually seek you see him when there's no lightning going on. Aha! But I said this in the video last time that that only was half of his health bar, so this doesn't look too good, like 
There's got to be a second part to this. Shoot him! Oh yeah, this part I don't quite get. Like, well, no. I, let me let me rephrase. I understand Ocelot's point of view. He's thinking the whole like, you know, fair fight. I can't do that. It like just because he's winning, I'm not gonna step in. You know. I made a promise to the boss. I think that's referencing the whole fight like warriors kind of thing. This part. So Ocelot uses the copper in the bullets to deflect the lightning bolts. Which, I mean, is cool and all, but why can't I do that? I got tons of guns. Are you questioning my authority? You know, his lightning is like stopping my bullets and stuff, but can still shock me. It's like, why can't I just shoot the lightning and have it be deflected? That makes no sense. Fight like a man, Volgin. Ouch. Volgin? Emergency. Explosives have been detected. Uh oh. All non EOD personnel must evacuate immediately. Uh oh. Ocelot, find those bombs. Repeat. Explosives have been detected. All non EOD personnel must uh, evacuate immediately. What's going Moment. on? Should have been like, fight him yourself. What? What is that thing? I don't, I don't understand. What are you trying to? I guess like you got this. I don't, I don't know what that means. Okay, who's up for round two? Ready for some more snake? Oh, I said, who's up for round two? Oh, in this one, you're supposed to be able to. Ha! Ah. Oh no! Oh. If you lay on the ground, you're supposed to be able to... Um... Not get hurt by that. Woo! Okay, so this kind of just got... Considerably harder. Oh crap. Nope, nope, nope. Just getting back up from that attack is the problem, really. Dang it! I really thought that was his back. Come on, man! How's that work? Oh no! That's not good. Oh crap! Come on! This is a Dark Souls moment where I'm getting pinned on the wall. Okay, we gotta, we gotta fix. We gotta fix. What do we get? Gunshot. We can fix that. I might sneeze in a minute. If my mic cuts out, that's why. Just saying. Just giving you a heads up. I don't know, but it gives me full stamina, so deal with it. Woo! Dang it, man. Curse you, auto-aim. Oh, crap. Let's see how you like this. I like it just fine, because I can shoot you in the back. Oh! We did it! Ha 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 Uh, now what? Uh, okay. Oh, I guess it's just a cutscene, okay. We're running a little low on time. I hope we can speed this up. You're not looking so good. Grounded. <laughs> I see what you did there. We need to move, dude. I mean, lightning boy aside, there's some explosives that are gonna blow up and all. Let's start climbing! Uh, 
let's move it, move it, move it. Everybody run! <laughs> where's where's the uh, Star Wars yell at? Ah! <laughs> it's in like every Star Wars movie. Be great, he runs by Ocelot and just like smacks him in the jaw as he's running by. Give me a save point, come on. Don't do another cutscene. We don't have time for this. Or we could do another cutscene. Hop in. You don't have to tell me twice. It's a hangar that's about to blow up. Step on it. We are going faster. We can't go any faster. <laughs> Sucks to be them. Why are we stopping? Don't give up. Get moving. Eva. He's like on fire. Eva. How did you? The boss let me go. The boss. Plot twist. Why? I'll tell you later. Right now we've got to get to the lake and escape. We can't leave yet. I've still got one last job to do. Besides the fact that um we haven't actually blown up the Shagahod yet. Huh? She's at the lake. She's waiting for you there. Waiting for me. Yeah, this gets really interesting towards the end here. I was hoping I wouldn't have to tell you. Can we get a little bit further away from the burning building with the nuclear tank? I don't want you to fight her. Well, that's going to be a problem. But I I've come to realize that there's a special relationship between you two. Something I can't understand. Something that goes beyond a man and a woman. I envy you. It's two warriors. Really, I do. But I guess I just can't understand it. Nope. Not really. She asked me to tell you something. Screw you! <laughs> that would be kind of funny. There. I said it. Oh! Where I've never seen something, someone with such clear eyes as yeah. what she's supposed to be saying. I thought she was meaning... I've never seen anybody have clearer eyes than the boss. See, this is why you're supposed to confirm things are blown up before doing your victory dance. It kinda sounds like a dinosaur. Oh yeah. There is no escape. Don't you have enough scars on your face? Do you really mean me to put more on? Not good. <laughs> All right, I think yeah. Okay, we're done. We're going to end it here. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.